Central Bank Governor Dr. Patrick Njoroga says some sectors of the economy are already showing signs of recovery. He attributes this to measures taken by some international players to restart their economies. Our business editor Henry Githaiga has those details. It has been a tough four months for most Kenyans with the impact of the coronavirus rippling through the economy resulting in the imposition of stringent measures that have had a direct impact on individual livelihoods. The government's imposition of partial lockdowns, cessation of movement and a don't to dust curfew, making it difficult for businesses to maintain profitability. In addition, social distancing requirements have made it difficult even for the most basic of businesses to operate. There could, however, be a light at the end of the tunnel with the Central Bank of Kenya now indicating that the economy could begin recovering as early as July this year. We are looking at a sort of a smoother, you know, more gentle recovery um, so that towards the end of the year, you know, we are again, or the fourth quarter, we are again at uh, maybe where we could have been, you know, sort of things have, have largely come back to normal. According to the latest data from the central bank, key sectors such as horticulture are on the rebound with export volumes now standing at 60% of what they were before the onset of the coronavirus. We should also say that this is on the back of uh, various government policies or various policies um, and indeed uh, negotiation and approval and indeed uh, implementation of uh, more cargo spaces or more cargo flights. The local economy is also receiving a boost from diaspora remittances, with Kenyans in the diaspora continuing to send back cash to their families and dependents back home. According to CBK, remittances coupled with government interventions in form of the economic stimulus package are having a positive impact on the economy. It has actually targeted uh, the critical sectors and from the perspective of jobs, so employment, um, that is key wages that is the, really the focus so in a sense targeted and therefore um, w w less likely to or rather more likely to be effective despite the optimism dr njeroge cautions that more needs to be done to protect msmes and smes which have less than two months worth of cash reserves in addition sectors such as tourism could take longer to reopen as they are dependent on the opening up of international borders and the availability of disposable income. The central bank also noted a marked decline in the collection of excise duty, a clear indicator that there has been a massive decline in consumption, with a large section of the population having lost their jobs or having taken a pay cut. Henry Gedaiga, KTN News.